Hello, everybody. <clears throat> Check out my Sterling engine here. What this is, this is a little kit that I bought from Contax out in England a few months back. And um, I, I'm very, very intrigued by it. This thing is so efficient. It's very, very cool. What this is, is technically an external combustion engine because the heat source is on the outside of the engine. You can see I put the hot water into the cup. And this consists of uh, um, two pistons. One, you can see the big styrofoam piston on the inside. And then you can see a little uh, heavy uh, metal piston uh, in this little chamber. Now, I'm sure that those two are balanced about uh, the same weight. I suppose if I took it apart, I could, I could tell that for sure. And then you'll also notice the flywheel. Now, this is technically an engine which literally has to warm up. As you can see, um, it hasn't actually started moving yet. I put the hot water in there and I've waited. And we're waiting. We're waiting for this to turn over a little bit. Um, and uh, let's wait a little bit more. I may just give it a little touch. Uh, to, to get it started if, um, if, if uh, you know, we start uh, waiting a little bit too long here. Uh, but I've actually, let's try that here. Uh, maybe not. I'll just give it a little touch once again. Not even doing a full revolution on the flywheel yet. There we go. So I've actually, um, <coughs> put hot water in here and I, I've uh, put it in the cup and I've put this on top and it's actually has gone, I kid you not, for about three hours and I thought wow that's really good and then after um, I did that what I did was that I, I poured out the hot water and then I took a cup of ice water like you can see here I put the Stirling engine on top of the ice water and then what happened was that in fact the um, the engine then went again as well for about another three hours. So it's amazing the amount of energy that's actually in just a cup of water when you think of it. Now, this is a little too weak to do any real work, although it is certainly turning the flywheel around. But what I have heard is that Dean Kamen, who is the same guy who has made the the, uh, the Segway, has actually now is now working on a Sterling engine that will <coughs> be used in, in hybrid cars. So very, very cool. Look how fast that's going. It's going at about um, about 120 RPM, I, I expect. And um, do take a look. This is from Contax in, in England. Uh, if you want to order it there, I paid about, uh, I guess around, I don't know, somewhere between 80 and and $100 for it. And uh, it's very, very cool. Would highly recommend it. It makes a great science experiment. And enjoy.